Hansen. Just let your applause die away quite not. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Some of you have been here before. <laughs> you know, a little what? Oh, what? Why? When did I start walking like this? I just did. I just right there. It's like I'm possessed by someone fabulous. <laughs> I just went. Oh, hey, you know what? <laughs> By the way, I am possessed by someone fabulous. <laughs> wait, wait, I don't know what that means. Don't applaud it. <laughs> what was I talking about? Uh, oh, it's Thursday. Yes! Oh, I love Thursday. <sighs> <sighs> oh, it's my favourite day named after Thor. <laughs> Thursday, Thursday. It's named after Thor. It's Thursday. It's named after. <laughs> Don't give me that skeptical look, you passive aggressive. <laughs> I, thought, I, oh, I, I can't say that. I thought I could say that. I can't say that. I thought I could say that. <laughs> I'd like to apologise on behalf of me <laughs> and CBS. A great day for America, everybody. So, listen, because it's Thursday, last night, Wednesday night, I went, I did something I normally do on hump day. <laughs> which is Wednesday. I went, I went to the movies. <laughs> Why did you go to the movies on hump day, Craig? I hear you ask in your high-pitched Scottish voice. I will tell you. <laughs> I, well, you know, I, you probably think, why, why, why would you go to the movies, Craig? What is it about having an infant crying and pooping all over your house that made you seek the quiet, dark sanctuary of a movie theatre? Why would that eight-month-old tyrant... Why is that something that small go... And, like, I was all complaining about him, and I said to my wife, oh, come on, the baby's really loud, and she went, yeah, I wonder where he gets that. You know, you're as passive-aggressive as him sometimes. <laughs> anyway, I saw, I saw the movie Warrior, which has been out for a while, I will admit. And the theatre was uh, kind of empty and sad, like me. But... <laughs> not really. I'm as happy as this all the time, because I'm very high! <laughs> no, it's, it's a good movie, actually. The guy who plays the lead has, is, is great. Uh, his name is Tom, Tom Hardy. We have a picture of him? There you Whoa, there you are. There's him, right there. <laughs> Yep. He's in the next Batman movie. He plays Batman's sidekick, Throbin. <laughs> <laughs> Nick Nolte was in the movie too. It was a great performance. Nick Nolte actually offered to get me a copy of the movie on DVD. He was going to drive it over himself. I'm like, nah, it's safer if I just go to the theatre now. <laughs> He's like, oh, bring it! And I'm like, no! Anyway, movies about uh, MMA, that's mixed martial arts. And watching those fighters I, I, I made me feel really out of shape. It inspired me. Next week, I'm going to do a push-up. <laughs> <laughs> then I'll get some exercise. <laughs> <laughs> I know how creepy I am. I'm aware. <laughs> this is the way I am. Hate me because I'm creepy, why don't you? or enjoy it. <laughs> anyway, if you don't know about the MMA, it's a kind of a fusion of boxing and karate and uh, the uh, Brazilian jiu-jitsu and stuff. It, it means you can pretty much do what you want. You know, you can punch and kick or do what I do. You can pee your pants, run away. It's in the rules, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> Crying is allowed. 
it's in the rules. Well, the, my favourite MMA technique was the one I used when I was dating, which is grappling. <laughs> Creepy is that? Yeah. Hey! <laughs> anyway, the MMA is like, it's like boxing, but you can use your feet. So it's basically just a bar fight with a couple of extra rules. And the, the top MMA fighters are schooled in the Brazilian martial art known as uh, capoeira. That's how it's pronounced, isn't it? Capoeira. Where you get your opponent to submit. Submit. <laughs> uh, don't try and understand this. It's very complicated. There's the capoeira, and then you've got to get your opponent to submit. What do you mean submit? I know what I mean. <laughs> no, you get your opponent to submit by, you know, it's Brazilian. You wax them. <laughs> That's what happens. You, you, run, you run up to them, they're like, ah, oh, you're like, wax, wax, wax. Ah. Wax, wax, wax. Ah. And they're like, ah, oh, wax, wax, wax. And then you run around and you run around until it hardens, and then you go, wah -ha! You know that, uh, <laughs> you know that John McCain once called MMA, uh, he, he said it was human cockfighting. Well, Senator, you're wrong, Senator. I have, I have seen human cockfighting. That looks nothing like the MMA. In human cockfighting, they don't wear shorts. I can say that. Can I say that? I'm just describing something. <laughs> anyway, the MMA uh, fights take place inside the ring called the Octagon, because that and that's cool. Everything uh, the shape of an octagon is cool. Uh, stop signs. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's, uh, that's all I got. Stop signs. Oh, they're so cool. Every time I have to stop, and just have a look at them. Every time I see them, like I drive up and I'm like, no, I'm got. I gotta. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Anyway, the walls of the octagon are badass as well, because they're just like a chain-link fence, which means you can slip notes and flowers and baked goods to your favourite fighter. <laughs> Enjoy the muffins, Rampage Jackson. <laughs> and also the baked goods. The, uh, the, uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Is it? That was a joke. So Rampage Jackson's been here, he's my favourite MMA fighter, he's been on the show and he's one of the few guests that have been here that could kill me with their bare hands. It's a pretty short list, it's Rampage Jackson, Betty White, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you're awake man, are you? Are, are you awake or did you, was that a kind of... What was that? No, I've been very excited during this monologue. <laughs> Why? Because of the human... <laughs> Go ahead, say it, yeah. Human cockfighting? <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, man. Knock it off. You're being a, you're being a cliche. All right, all right, relax. <laughs> hey, what was that move you were talking about? The capybara? What was that? <laughs> yeah, the, ca the macarena. I don't know, something like that. I have this vision of you waxing a capybara. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that's a lot of waxing. They're, they're, they've got a lot of fur on them, then. They sure do. It's like a giant rat. This, this is like the Discovery Channel, but not as well lit. You got that right. Yeah, no kidding. All right, come on. Commercial break time. Get it Let's going. Let's do it. All right. Tonight's program is brought to you by the new action thriller Bone Man and Throbin. Jeff Peterson is Bone Man, Craig Ferguson is Throbin, and he's also in this film. Hey! <laughs>